In this video, we'll look into how we can create lookups of key values in SQL spreads. Using these lookups, we can select a text in the drop-down list, while SQL spreads will save the corresponding key value back to the database. In this order table, we have a customer column. The customer column has a key value that is related to our table with our customers. To simplify the updating of this table, we can create a lookup in SQL spreads for a column. To create a lookup for a column, head over to the designer and click the lookup icon on the right side of the column. Select the database and table where you need to do the lookup. In this example, we will do the lookup in the customer table. Now, select which column that contains the matching key value, in this case, the customer ID. Lastly, select what to show in the drop-down list in Excel. In this case, we select to show the name of the customer. Click OK, and you will see that the key values are replaced with the customer names. Now, we select another customer and save the change. The customer ID for that selected customer will be written back to the database. In the order table, we also have a status flag, and we would like to make it easier for our users to set that flag. To do that, we can create a simple lookup in SQL spreads that will show a text to the user but write the flag back to the database. To create this list lookup for the flag, we go over to the designer and click the lookup icon for the status column. Then we go to the second tab, Lookup in List, and we enter a list of flags that should be written to the database and the texts to show for those flags. When we click OK, you can see that the status flags are replaced with the texts from our lookup list. Now we can select a text, and when we save, the corresponding flag will be written into the database. And there you go. In this video, we have looked into how you can use lookups in SQL spreads to simplify updating tables with relations. We've created drop-down lists that will look up values in related database tables and also created a drop-down list for more simple cases where we have the keys and texts in a simple list. 